$1 billion period of adjustment. Okay. After that, they appealed it to the board. The board granted them an additional year of adjustment. And uh, based on the statute of limitation, that's all we could give. Okay. Um, we have no other public speakers on this. I think we'll go ahead and approve the recommendations and send that to council as a report from the chair. Is the appellant here? Do you wish to speak? No? Okay. Okay. We'll go ahead and send that item forward. Okay. Concur with the action taken by the Board of Public Works? Yes. Okay. Right. Approved. Thank you. Thank you. Next item, number five. Number five, DWP report relative to authorizing agreement number 47183-3 with OS-1 SAW for the Pi Historian System Maintenance Program. Hello, welcome. Just a quick uh, overview of this, please. Um, hello, my name is Marcel DePaulo. I'm, a, I'm the manager over in Power System Information Advanced Technologies. And basically what this contract over here is for, um, it's a five-year contract for our OSI software system, which is our data file historian for our computer system that we run at ECC. It's used for collecting data, collecting analysis of where the power is coming from our wind farms, from our substations. And what we're asking for is approval of a $7.3 million contract, which is for three years plus two optional one-year extensions. Okay, and I understand that CAO and DWP have worked out the uh, amount of the contract. Is that correct? Yes, and if I were to put it in a, a simple manner so that the uh, audience can understand, uh, this is a system which uh, takes is the maintenance of, of one that has been developed to take all the different databases and put them into one so that everybody is talking to each other on the same okay. system. Great. Good. So we'll move this item to full council. Thank you. Next item. Item number seven. TDP report as well as CAO report relative to approval of the power purchase agreement with the Manzana Wind Limited Liability Corporation for energy and capacity. Okay. Let's take seven and eight together. Um, we have one public speaker on this, and uh, um, it's okay. We just, we'll take the public speaker card, if that's okay. Um, William Ernest Shenewek. Work. And that matter relates to DDP report relative to large generator interconnection agreement with K-Road. Okay. Okay, I provided a written uh, testimony, which I believe is in the record. Basically, I'm worried that these rates are so low that these power suppliers may fold up financially. Okay. And you have written testimony on that? Well, if you could give that to our sergeant there. Thank you. So we'll move both those items, seven and eight, to full council. Okay. okay. We're good. Thank you. And that leaves you with item number one. Okay. Now we are in item number one. Okay, and if anybody sees any extra seats, can you please take them? I was told by our sergeants that we are filled to capacity. And uh, um, for fire emergency reasons, um, we may have to go to an overfill room, but I'm trying to avoid that if we could take up seats that are not taken. So anybody sitting over here, um, if you could take some seats, please, so we wouldn't have to send you over to the uh, overfill room. Thank you. Mr. Chair, for the record, would yeah. you like to um, close the meeting, the energy and environment meeting, and then open the ad hoc waste reduction and, and recycling committee now? And then what I will do is I will transfer and move um, from one system to the other because I have to open up. Yes, can I, can I do that given that the chair or nobody, well, I'm on the uh, ad hoc. Yes, 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 we could do that. I'm on, I'm, on, I'm on both. So, okay. Yes. We could do that. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. And uh, can we read item number one into the record, please?